In our first story, former Punjab Chief Minister Captain Amrinder Singh has quit the Congress party and is likely to support the BJP in the crucial state elections in 2022. India's grand old Congress party suffered another major humiliation as the recently removed Chief Minister of Punjab and one of party's oldest and strongest leaders, Captain Amrinder Singh announced he was quitting the party. Singh said he would not join the BJP. PIO TV has predicted his departure from Congress. Amrinder's decision came after he met confidants and top officials of the Prime Minister Narendra Modi government. Amrinder had meetings with National Security Advisor Ajit Doval on 30th September, a day after meeting Union Home Minister Amit Shah. Captain said he had flagged the security situation in Punjab, where Pakistan was fomenting trouble by sending weapons through drones. He said the Congress is going downhill with senior leaders completely ignored. The former CM said he was still considering his options, but Punjab's security was his top priority. Sources said Singh may have also discussed the farmer's issue with Amit Shah. He discussed the dangerous designs of Pakistan with Ajit Doval. Persons close to Amrinder said the veteran Sikh regiment captain was rearing for an electoral fight in the upcoming state assembly elections and avenges humiliation at the hands of the Congress party. It may well be that Amrinder will float his own regional political outfit as he enjoys a massive following. Also, it is evident that his party will align in some manner with the BJP in the state elections slated for 2022. It is quite obvious that Captain's new innings will be woven around forgy nationalist plank and dwell on Sidhu's love and admiration for Pakistan Prime Minister Imran Khan and their Army Chief Kamar Javed Bajwa in sharp contrast. The former Punjab CM has already identified Sidhu as his political adversary and has announced that he will not let the former cricketer win the forthcoming Assembly election.